The USFL is a second chance league, not only for itself as it's been resurrected back here in Birmingham, but also for many of its players, including one former Blazer, Nick Vogel, who has kicked his way to the top of the league while making the most of his second chance opportunity. Love UAB, it's probably one of my proudest things about me. So it's been an honor going out there and seeing a couple of the UAB fans, Bill Clark on the sideline, a couple of the guys. Familiar view for Clark who got to watch Vogel as his head coach from 2014 to 2019. We knew Nick was super talented. You know, obviously he played on our first championship team and was part of the return. Uh, and, you know, Nick is more than just a, a kicker. And why I say that is because he's, you know, he's a field goal guy. He's a kickoff guy. You saw him make that big tackle on the kickoff, but he's an athlete. The respect was and still is mutual. He was a giant, giant influence on my decision to come back because I know the kind of culture he had and I knew if, if I came and played for him, no matter what kind of team he fielded, it was going to be a winning team. And Vogel's loyalty helped lead UAB's successful return to football. And now he's leading kickers and points during the USFL's return with the Houston Gamblers. Before the season, I did have a goal to be one of the top guys in the league. That's kind of your, your goal is to make it to the next level, go to the NFL. So that, that was in my sights. But when I'm out in the field, I'm not focusing about the big picture. It's a very small picture. Make the kick, set your team up in the best position, and, and really emphasize, you know, just doing your job when you're out there, not trying to do too much. Last Sunday, Nick did a lot, kicking the longest field goal in his career from 53 yards. It's a, it's a must-make kick, and in my head, I was just at all costs trying to put the ball in. Um, they were talking a little crap before the kick, so they gave me a little extra juice, and that might have been what you've seen afterwards. But um, I try to just stay in the moment and not focus on any of my particular stats. It was just helping the team and try to give us the win at that point. And he seems to keep doing that in this league and hopes to one day do it in the NFL. And along with many Blazers fans, there's another person who will definitely be watching. Just to get him back, to get him back in Birmingham is a big deal. We're, we're super proud of him and uh, look forward to see what the future holds for him. Nick Vogel and the Houston Gamblers will finish out on Sunday as they take on the Pittsburgh Maulers to wrap up week five of the USFL. Here at Protective Stadium, Carrie Osep, WBTM 13, back to you.